Hello, today I'm going to show you how to download and use torrents. Now, torrents is a, using torrents is a way to get free music and movies, but you can also get legal stuff too. When you get um, music and movies, obviously it's illegal, so be aware. First step is to open up a new tab, and in this tab, you're going to be downloading... Uh, a torrent client, oh, just which is a way to download a torrent. So for a Windows computer, you want uTorrent, which is U and then torrent. Search that on Google and select the first link, which is uTorrent.com. So you can put that into, and then you'd select Get uTorrent. Um, after this, after it's installed, you will ex uh, install it and then you'll be ready to go. If you're on a Mac, I'd suggest using Transmission. I'm oh, sorry. Uh, it's transmissionbt.com. I'll post these links on the side. Uh, from here you go to download and hit that. After this you'd mount the DMG file and you'd drag it to drag the application into your applications folder. Once you have a BitTorrent client, which you have just downloaded, which is either uTorrent or Transmission, and after it is fully installed, now you obviously have to find a torrent. So there are many, many websites in which you can find these. Uh, there's the Pirate Bay, which is one of the most known ones, along with Mini Nova, ISO Hunt, etc. But it's good to find one that searches all of the websites together. So I found torrents with a Z dot com. Oops. Dot com. Now once this loads, you see there's a search box and then there's the most common used keywords. So if you don't really know what to look for, you can just, here, 2008 DVD rip, because it's the biggest, is probably uh, the most searched keyword. So you would go ahead and click on that, and it just searches it for you. And you can see that there are all of these, all of these torrents. And what you want to look for is more seeds than peers. This website doesn't really do a good demonstration of that, so, um, here, I'll find, a uh, 21 was a good movie. And then it just takes you to another site, and you download it from there. So, I'll go to Mini Nova, and then download this torrent, and you see... There are slightly more seeds than leechers, so this this would be a little bit slow of a download. You want significantly more seeds than leechers. This only has like 600-ish more seeds, but we can try it. So download this torrent. The seeds are the people giving the information, and the leechers are the ones, I guess, leeching and um, taking the information. So you'd save the file. And it's this is just a small file. And then after that, you'd open it up with a torrent client that you have just got. Once you have downloaded this torrent.torrent .torrent file, you're going to want to open it up in the BitTorrent client that you have downloaded. Now, this is not default. For example, my computer doesn't know what to do with this. So you would right-click or control-click on a Mac, open with, and then select... Uh, for me, transmission, or for Windows, uTorrent. Now, you can also open this up uh, in, like, a LimeWire, FrostWire, any file sharing thing, but I'd still suggest transmission. So you select the, the files that you want to download from this .torrent file. I only need the movie, which is the AVI file, and I would select Add. Once your torrent download has started, which might take a little while to get the peers, uh, it'll go at a relatively fast pace, depending on how popular the movie is, or whatever you're downloading. This is downloading 
around 40 to 50 kilobytes a second, or 30 to around 30 now. And this is going to take a very long time. So it goes very back and forth. Like I've gotten 9 megabytes and it's just been 2 minutes about. So the more peers that it has, uh, well, the more peers that it's downloading from, pretty much the faster that you'll download. Please go to howto4computers.blogspot.com for more tutorials. Bye.